Hello. 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 Who gave you attention? No, that's not bad. Two minutes out of what, seven days. Here it is. Yeah. You hung up the phone. Yeah, I did. Yeah, so whose fault is that? Well, tired of hearing about Alex being so far up your ass. Here you go, mentioning him again. All we did is go to fucking brunch. Yeah. Um, well, and then we had sex afterwards, but... Yeah. Well, you're bringing it to a point where, I, where I'm not going to doubt it. Yeah. Well, it's like you can't go a day without having something to do with him. I can't. I can't go a single day without him. Yeah, well, obviously, when you spend a whole fucking night with him on a hot date and then let him sleep over. You mean a seriously hot all night long date? Yep. Yeah, it was so fucking hot. Yeah, must have been. You let him sleep over again. I sat on his lap the entire time. Well, I'm not going to be surprised because you can't yeah. seem to sleep. Can't seem to go a day without him. I can't. Too hard. When he's not here, I'm just thinking about him. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure. Yeah. That's the point you're bringing it to, to make me mm-hmm. think like that. Yeah. I mean, you can't Obviously. go a day without mentioning him. Obviously, he thinks that way because he thinks that every weekend now he gets to spend time with you, and it's all. Yeah, every, every weekend's week. Alex's weekend. It's been that way for how many weekends now? Uh, Four that two. I know of. Four that I know of. I think two. Four that I know of, Casey. All right, what four? Because I only recall two. The four since we've been back talking to each other every weekend. The four every weekends? I, I told you three weekends ago. That he's going to think, because of the weekend before that weekend, which would be the fourth, or the very first weekend, after you and I started talking, the following weekend, he did the same thing. And I told you it was going to become a pattern. He's going to think that every weekend he gets to spend time with you. And look at what's happened. It's the same thing over and over, regardless of how I feel about anything. Yeah. And you can't miss out on brunch today. You gotta gotta see him. I mean, I mean, he's gotta see well, I you. Have to eat. Otherwise, he'll go in convulsions without seeing you. You gotta eat. Yeah, you can't, you can't go out to McDonald's and get your own breakfast. You gotta have brunch with Alex. McDonald's? You eat the, I'm not a broke ass bitch. I don't eat McDonald's. Oh, sorry. He had he had to go to a fancy restaurant with Alex. I'm sorry. My bad. Yeah, I want a friend Tom with. They don't have those in McDonald's. Oh, so sorry. It's my bad on that one. Okay. They don't have Bloody Marys in McDonald's. Yeah, see? Gotta have drinks with them. Got yeah. The alcohol involved. Yeah, there has to be. Well, apparently. I take my panties off. Yeah. Well, what do you want me to feel? I don't fucking care. Uh, feel however you want. Not. Yeah, feel however you want. What's it matter to me? If you don't like it, get the fuck away from me. No, Casey, I love you. I don't like him. Why do you think I'm having, having such a fit about him? It's because of the way I feel about you. How are you in love with me? Casey, we've known each other for a year now. So? You think, I'm just sitting, you think I'm just sitting around playing with my dank and my toes? Yeah, probably. How does that I mean? A lot of, I think a lot about you. So? Even when, even when the, the throuple was going on, I was thinking Jealousy less and less. Jealousy isn't about, Lauren. I was thinking about less and less about Jamie and more about you. Jamie doesn't exist, Lauren. Exactly, but at the time we didn't know that. Otherwise, you wouldn't have made a trip to Nashville. So what does a year's time have to do with anything? 
What is my what? A sucker for a year. Huh? What does a year have to do with anything? You love me because it's been a year? I love you because I, I love the way you are. No, you don't. I like to get drinks with my friend. You hate that. Yeah, I do hate that. You don't like anything that I do. You got to take the good with the bad, but I don't have to take Alex. Well, you do. I put up with it. No, you don't. I've been putting up with it. Why do you think I'm getting getting so irritated you about him. You bitch about him constantly. Yeah, but I do. Of course I do. It's very unattractive. Well, it's very unattractive that you're constantly wanting to be around him. I don't care if you find it attractive. It's very unattractive that you go out and describe your your outing with him like a hot date, then you let him sleep over. Like an all night. How, how am I supposed to find that attractive? I don't what care. Do you go find a fucking chick in Maine then, who has no friends, who wants to eat McDonald's breakfast with you. Why? Because Alex means more to you than I do. No, because if you don't want to put up with him, then you can go. Well, you want to tell me why you have to have him stay the night at your house? That's because bullshit. I want him to. Because uh, you want him to. Well, geez, that makes me feel so much better, KC. Yeah, I care about my friends. Yeah, well, that's what they make Ubers for. Yeah, I don't want him to pay for an Uber. I'd rather him stay at my house where I know he's safe. And you don't think he'd be safe at his own house? No. Yeah, that's a good way of thinking. Okay. Jesus. That's fucked up, Casey. That's really fucked up. Well, I don't know. You do what you want to do. You can let me know when you want me and not that fucking piece of shit in your life. I'm not fucking around with this stupid, retarded, theorist bullshit. Um, like, what are you saying? like a fucking retard, and he is a retard. Okay. And you're being just as retarded by fucking going into his bullshit. He's been a problem for us since the fucking day you met him. At least Alex knows how to speak intelligently. There, there you go. Stick up for your boyfriend, Casey. I'm sticking up for me. You just call me retarded. Uh, you're not sticking up for you because you got that asshole in your goddamn life. See how you're retarded? That doesn't make any sense. You're not sticking up for you. You're sticking up for you. You get the fuck rid of him. How would that be sticking up for me? It's straight up like talking to a mentally challenged person right now. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Why would you let him in your life? Because I want him in my life. Well, apparently you do because you want all kinds of time with him. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Is there anything else you want to say to me or have we met our No, I, I, I don't want to. I don't want to take up all your time that you can spend with your boyfriend. Okay.